All right, recall from class the basic logic gates, right? We have the, uh, we have basically the NOT gate, which have, which is, uh, let's see, this guy right here. So that's the NOT gate, right? And what does that do? It takes in the output Y is written as A, with a bar over it and it's pronounced as, as y is not a right this guy here is or gate the output is true if either a is true or b is true or both of them are true right so we write this as y equals a or b okay although I'm writing a plus here in this class you're going to pronounce it as A or B. Okay? So why is true if either A is a 1 or B is a 1. Okay? And finally the third gate we looked at is the AND gate. AND gate. Right? Now as the name suggests the output is true if input A is true and input B is true. So y is written as a dot b and read as y is a b or we can just simply write this as b without a dot okay so that's also perfectly fine and in this class a lot of the time i will most likely use this uh convention okay now let's look at this circuit Okay, this circuit. Our goal is to find what the output expression is at F. Okay, we have inputs A, B, C, D, and we have a network consisting of NOT gates, also called inverters, AND gates, and OR gates. Okay, so let's look at what the Boolean expression is. So let's start from here. So we have A here. Right, so we have this is A, right? Now B goes through this NOT gate, comes out here as B with a bar, so that's NOT B. Right? So here's B again, gets ended with C. So there's B from here, ended with C. So this is B and C which we write as BC here we have A we have A ended with not B so we write that as A not B okay. so how about this point this point has this input which is A not B or so this is OR gate right so, or BC so we write this as A not B or BC okay now down here we have input D which feeds into a NOT gate so the output is D with a bar so that goes in and feeds this AND gate the other input to the AND gate comes from the top A not B or B C so F is equal to F I don't have space there so I'm going to write it down here so F is equal to this whole expression right here which is A not B or B C and so big parentheses here. Oops, let me make that right. And not D. So this expression basically represents this big circuit. Okay, so this is how you look at a circuit and derive its uh, boolean expression.